Hey, it's Mike again from the Big Rock Ranch. If you put your rotary cutter on and never take it off, you probably don't want to be watching this video. Uh, but if you change implements off and in back of the tractor, I want to show you some things on the deluxe tractors that might save you a bunch of time and a bunch of heartache uh, in trying to switch implements. I have times with my tractor where I've got the brush hog on, I need to feed a bale of hay, I have to go take the brush hog off, put the bale spike on, then I need to grade the driveway, I have to put a blade on, and then I want to take the blade off and put the brush hog back on so I'm ready to mow the next time. And if you do that two or three times a day, you're like, whoa, this hooking and unhooking is a hassle. Well, there's a couple of options on a tractor that will speed up that process. And a lot of times I have people ask me, mo most of the tractor lines have one model that's anywhere from $1,000 to $2,000 more than another model. And a lot of people buy the lower end model just to keep the cost down, and that's fine. They, they're, they're, they're great functioning tractors. But you get what you pay for. When you, when you pay that extra money, a lot of times you get options like the ones I'm going to show you now that'll really save you a gob of time. One of them is extendable lower links. The bottom end of your three point, the, the, the lower lift arms, are fixed on the inexpensive tractor uh, for the most part. On the higher end tractors, they are extendable on the end. And let me show you how that works. You can move a lever and pull them out and move them in. So when you're trying to hook up an implement, you want to back up really, really close to it, and then you can pull up the lever, slide out the extendable link, hook it on, do the same with the other side, and then when you're hooked up, you can back up and they click into place. It's a lot easier than getting fixed arms both matched up exactly and getting that implement hooked onto the tractor. Another thing that the uh, higher end tractors have a lot of times are stabilizers with a pin in them instead of a turnbuckle system. Almost every tractor has a stabilizer arm to keep the implement from going back and forth in back of the tractor when you're using it. That, that implement needs to be tight back there so it doesn't swivel from one end to another. So a lot of tractors have a turnbuckle system where you turn a turnbuckle to lock it in place. It's, it's great exercise for the lower arms. It can make you look like Popeye. But if you're changing in implements a lot, that screwing and unscrewing that turnbuckle gets old. On the more deluxe tractors, you have a, a sleeve system with a pin where you can just pull that pin up, move your arms out, hook on, and then when you get the implement where you want it, put that pin back in place and you're gone. Lot simpler system, but it costs money. Um, another area on the three point that the more deluxe tractors will usually have, instead of having a turnbuckle, to raise the lower link arms. In other words, if you're trying to hook up your implement and the last time you left it there, say you left it on dirt and it settled a little bit on one side, it's not level anymore. Just about every tractor's got a system on the lower three-point arms to raise and lower one or both of them. Hook up the one that is fixed first and then the other one, usually the lower end tractors have a turnbuckle to, just like the stabilizers, to raise and lower that lower link arm. The more deluxe tractors will have a crank, and the crank is just easier. It's, 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 uh, it keeps you away from the back end of the, crawling clear under the back end of the tractor, and it's a lot easier to raise and lower. So those options are something you want to look at when you're buying a tractor. If you're going to be changing implements in the back a lot, it might be good to go ahead and invest in the higher feature tractor that has those features so you can get in and out of your implements faster.